So we've, we have... Oh. We have been in here before, have we? I don't know if we have. We might be able to get in. It's not really been seen. Could be gentle if they spot me. Quick save. If they're not coming back, what I'll do? Got the roof. This is where the leech dissects her. The roof is uh, always the best place for me, at least. Oh, however, there is a guard on the other side, so I won't take them out. <gasps> oh, this is a little different. here. Oh, the good thing is... Wait, can I... Mm, can I maybe take some of them out? Oh shit, are they coming up here? Oh, they might be. They skedaddle up to the roof now. Basically, if it goes wrong, I just want to be able to take out some of these dudes beforehand. So I can just be like, there's none left. Stop moving, stop moving! Somehow got you. Okay. Shit. Got you. Missed opportunity. Though of he. That was a close one. Oh, oh no. Wait, can we go? Yes. Oh no, right. Up, 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 up. <laughs> okay. So I've thinned down the number of people out there. That's fine. Oh man. Right. So, go back in here. Where is she going? God go with you, Sister Predestined. And with you, child. 
Is she going to be going through here? Might be the easiest one if she comes through here. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Valhalla. <laughs> of course! That's no. I mean, I've been playing this for 70 odd hours, so. It's not that bad. I think I'll probably have to do everything over again, though. There we go. I know. I was doing so well in the killing. I hadn't been seen. Watch this go a very different way. Now, guns bla- well, guns blazing? Sword swinging. There we go. Sword swinging. <laughs> I I have a, a bad track record when it comes to Assassin's Creed in the game wanting to work or not work. I'm good at getting it to not work. See when Origins came out because there'd been a two year gap. I ended up going through all of them from the first one, um, excluding Chronicles, Bloodlines, Freedom Cry, and Liberation. Um, I played everything else, all the, the other main ones. And wow! It's so interesting to see like the evolution going from one game to the next, and also what happened. Like, <laughs> when, it, when it came to the bugs as well, uh, there were some that, I can't remember, was it Unity or Rogue, where I had people, I was killing them and they were flying into the air, uh, or there was, in 3, um, I had a, at the start, I think you're, are you playing as Hatham? And... I was on the rooftop and I had someone else, one of the other NPCs who we were supposed to be interacting with. Uh, so he's on the rooftop, like, crouched down, and his head, his head's just spinning. Like a mont, like, you know, exorcist style. <laughs> it's brilliant. <clears throat> Some bugs are great in this game. Some of them, not so much. Oh, oh no. Shit. Before, it's before I've done anything, I think. That was, that was fun, playing Assassin's Creed games. Origins. Uh, it's probably the least buggy of the modern ones that I've played. Odyssey had some... <laughs> I mean my game would break when I killed someone and it kind of stretched to oblivion. And at that point it would just start tanking. My frames would just go and I had to try and turn away from the body to get it working again. It was strange, very strange. I don't think you've played one since- oh the second game? Well I actually I didn't play the first Assassin's Creed until- not in full. Actually no, yeah. 
until I was going through the games before Origins came out because I had it on 360. My 360 kind of <laughs> backed in. Oh, thanks. Thanks. I'm here. I'm here. No. Right. Come on. This is where the leech dies. Let's go. Pray. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get this time. What did we do? We took out the you and you. We took out some of the guards in there. I always love the modern day section for Assassin's Creed. So people really like, you know, the content and what you're doing with the, the memories, the past. Uh, but I, I'm all for the, the modern day stuff where you're trying to figure out what the fuck's going on and um, Oh shit! Hey, who are you? You weren't here the last time. What? So yeah, they had a, a nice running theme from the second game to the end of three, and I think it was more Desmond, uh, the person who you were in present day, as kind of his story arc. And they finished that with you basically trying to stop the world from having a disaster, um, which ha which worked, it, you know, went well. And then they kind of lost their way. I kind of lost her way a bit when it came to... Here we go. Oh shit. Mm, no, I wouldn't do that. Because... they done some stuff. Up until Syndicate. And then they finished the story arc for the modern day in a comic. Like... How do you justify putting it in a comic? <laughs> oh, he's coming up here. He's not yet. I'm gonna try and assassinate his dude. Okay, it works for me. No, no, up, up the wall, up the wall. There we go. <laughs> Legs and hands. You know how to use them. Apparently not. Oh, are you at the? Are you at this? Wait, wait, wait. Mm, actually, no. You're a body. I won't hit you, will it? No. Come on. That's fine. I don't think you alerted anyone else to it. That should be fine there. Mm -hmm. Arrows. There were some here last time, wasn't there? Yes, there were. I like, please, please don't. Please don't bug out again. You weren't here before? <laughs> right, they're outside, that's fine. If she walks through either side, I might be able to kill them. You won't catch me going past the people's office. surface. Heard screaming last night. Comes down here. The gods here, are vigilant. Oh man, what are you doing? For the gift of your eyes, I thank you. 
Oh, I kind of really like this. It's quite violent, but at least it like, didn't know it's here having killed someone who's important. One more, that's all. I'm nearly finished. That's enough. She was taking eyes, was she? Oh, it's you. For all the dead, we can That's Odin. Dear sister, you and I are equals. Quite a charnel house. I I'd lost count of how many. I suppose I've been greedy in my research, but not for lack of care. The ancient ones. The Arbiters. They built us out of simple pieces. So easy to break. So difficult to mend. There must be an improvement. We should be stronger. Faster. So that's smarter. why she's... I could have fixed us. Taken bits and made us bodies. Better. We are blood and bone and spirit, Frida Swift. Perfect as we are. You've such beautiful eyes. Finish it. Would you? Oh jeez, they're coming to get her. <laughs> that isn't creepy in the slightest, is it? Some hey, people coming out. Her eyes have been removed. I have a feeling this is the missing Reitner. Oh, 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 oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Here we go, cool. I think we're fine. I have a section notes. Young girl of 16, peasant. Regna, uh, she was named. One oh one eye blue, the other green. Imprint of the ancient ones. What secrets will I find locked in this prison of meat and bones? Oh, he ends up killing her enemy. Oh no. Anything else? Or was that it? Where was it? Um, right. Let me go back to Erke. Oh no, actually, I can go up here. That's fine. <laughs> I kind of like how they're they're doing this um, historical side because you're you hearing off the the Isu and such through the, the Horde of the Ancients, which is basically the, the old version of the Templars. A oh, fudge. There we go. Oh, this is... yep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but this moment in time... Uh, Eivor, I don't think, knows anything really about them. Because most of the time, like, you're, you're either... I <laughs> didn't know this was a horror game, yeah. <laughs> um, yeah, in other games, you either... You're already an assassin. And two, you're born in a family that has ties to the Assassin Brotherhood and then you're kind of thrown into it when shit goes down with your rest of your family. And three... I can't remember. Um, Black Flag, you stumble across an outfit of a dude and you get embroiled in it. Rogue... You're part of the... <laughs> yeah, you're part of the Assassins but because of something that they do, you go fuck it and you you basically go the opposite way I'm not really sure you're 
classed as Templars because you want to be a Templar. Um, or if it's more of a... Wait, where the hell am I going? I'm the wrong way. Uh, you just don't want the assassins to continue doing what we're doing. Because there's a really nice section in Rogue right at the very beginning. You're running through. And what it is, the assassins have done something. Uh, and they have set in motion um, a terrible, terrible earthquake. And I'm, I'm sure, is it, is it Shay Cormac? No. You're the, the Irish assassin. Uh, and you end up going, fuck it. I didn't agree to this disaster. And what it is, is you're running through and there's buildings falling and it's basically like a, a free-running section through the, the destruction at right at the very beginning of the game. And that's what makes you change from an assassin onwards. But we've, we've not really been told much about either side at the moment. It is done. Ah! The leech is bled out. And did you catch a name? A nun. Name of Fredeswith. What? The good sister? <laughs> that can't be right. She was a saint. A healer and a... <laughs> God! That brick fits this week's wall of shit. <laughs> wall of shits! Oh! Her leech book? Oh no, I need to see. We found Regna. Breaker shit sounds about right. Breaker shit. She was shit. making dog meat out of Regna <laughs> when I found her. Fuck. You knew her? She saved me. Mended the broken leg. Thought I'd lose it. But not with Frida Sweet. You wouldn't know it was ever Leech broken. Boot. Yeah. The sands will run backwards now. Without her, we'll return to balancing humors. All of that for this. Secrets yeah, of the that human one. form. How she saved lives. And how she ended them. It so, might be the <clears throat> ravings of a mad woman. Not every problem has a clean okay, solution. Okay, talking. True. Very true. I've built my name selling the hard fix. I'll live with it. This was her fix. All her ideas and discoveries written here. Ill-gotten gains. I have a mind to burn that bloody tome. Is that the right call? Oh, right. Okay, so, the leech book, the book that she's holding. Uh, we got it from the, the healer, who was one of the Order. Uh, and from her dying little segment, she was killing people and doing stuff with their body parts to try and find a way to make people better, to alter them in some way. Because um, the Order is all about trying I don't know I, I get the impression they're trying to better themselves and become more like the Isu because they have been mentioned they keep mentioning the old like the gods the, the ancient ones who who made humans and they were like yeah they made us in such a, a breakable way and she was trying to um <laughs> in, a, in a very what the fuck roundabout way uh, make people better I'm gonna say keep it, and you can use anything, if, she, if there's anything regarding healing or fixing things that doesn't involve sacrifice, use it. It has cures yeah. for everything, from boils to broken bones, it's worth keeping. We fight wars to save those we love, and pay in blood for what we win. This book, this is your good sister's battlefield, her kingdom. You may be right, we can't return the dead to life. Their sacrifice can mean something. If you need me, I'll be at St. Paul's searching for something on the compass. Thanks for all this, Broca. Okay. Smashing the compass. What is it? Oh, I need to head off. I'm gonna get closer. Where it needs to be. And I'll save it and go. And then you get some food sorted. Oh, can we read this? 
Uh, who's Ivar? Ivar is um, the dude that Uba's brother. So when we were um, up in Leicestershire, we were helping uh, the Ragnarsons, the two brothers. It was Ivar. It was one of the brothers. Oh, leech book of. Was it Frida's with excerpt? Uh, if one coughs blood, ingest a three pennies weight of betony, grind in goat's milk, it offers three bowl bowls full to drink for three days. If people bleed from nose to amply, take fresh betony and rue, grind in vinegar, uh, ring together, just like. And insert into the nose for a day. For chest pain, find common centaury and caraway and boil these in clear ale for one hour and sip and drink. For nausea, boil root and wormwood uh, and marsh mallow and white horhound and ale. Add a honey to sweeten and drink uh, a draught as warm as a man's blood. Do so as often as there is need. Okay. Has he been in the game for a while? No. I think they like briefly mentioned him recently. But I can't remember what for. <clears throat> Emergency aim. Uh. Ooh. Can I get can I go and get that? Head towards that. Oh shit, I've still got two more. Yes, yeah, so smashing the compass will be starting with tomorrow. So the order I've got a few. I do need to try and defeat some of these dudes. Redwilda and Mufa. So defeat uh free just with she was a girl, she watched her sister fall off a horse and break her spine. She could see that while her sister's soul and mind were very much intact, her body was broken. It sparked an interest in anatomy that would follow her like the shadow of the fire that wiped out her entire family. I got info on the keel. Two more clues needed for him. Uh, note found on the leech. To the leech. I caution all in order. I have met the Norse called Eivor. Be wary, should you cross paths. Wait, we've met? Oh. Oh shit, a bearded man. Norseman who left Regia Filke. Bearded man knows Eivor personally as a great traveler. At this point, all bearded men look the same in this game to me. Don't find an arrow. I have news of the keel, and will tell you all next time we meet. But know this, the keel's thirst for travel knows no bounds. <laughs> They're all like, you know... Kinda, actually no, I was gonna say short, stout, rotund, bearded men, but some of them are a bit scrawny. <laughs> no, I. There's just nothing there. It distinguishes them to me. Not usually. But that's someone we know. Oh, who the fuck left there? I don't know. <laughs> Lumber sexual, lumberjack, male fantasies. <laughs> yes, um. Ivar. He was to do with. Uh, this section. So we took Tamar Fortress. Um, yeah. Lady Chestershire. <laughs> 